this is a an autobiography. Um, it's my journey on this book started about four or five years ago. Um, but before that, um, I, I wrestled with many of my adverse child experiences. Um, I grew up in a very challenging uh, family, difficult background in, in Hanover. Um, uh, so difficult that my single mother and three other uh, siblings, um, we, we moved a lot. So by the time I was uh, uh, nine or 10 years old, I'd lived in about eight or so places. Um, I, I struggled because of the, the issues with not having enough money to go to school, to get my, my books that I needed and learn to read when I was uh, 12 years old. And um, at 14 years old, um, cutting a very complex story short, I was um, thrown out of my extended family uh, yeah. setting and lived alone from 14 to 17 years old. And so some of the, the images in this book, some of the, the texts are very much about the distinct challenges that are, yeah. I face in, in these uh, uh, during this part of our time. Mm -hmm. And so um, the book is is very honest um, in, in this way, in the way that it, it speaks about the challenges that um, children um, go through. Um, but it's also, as I said, a book that is full of hope because yeah. um, for me, I, I received um, help. At times the help did not feel enough, but I, I, I guess in the end, it was enough for me to survive, to heal and to, to excel. So writing it for me, more than anything else was a sign of, of how much I had achieved. Mm -hmm. um, the book is my way of helping uh, children who are going through some of the things that I have been through. Um, if I had this book when I was uh, a 14 year old or a 10 year old, I think it would have made my journey much easier. Yeah. And so I had that in the back of my mind um, when things became very difficult when I felt I was going to um, the project was going to crash and that kept me me going and i'm, I'm i must say i i'm very grateful to the, the publisher for believing in this project it was really hard yeah. for others like dr uta kelly my dissertation supervisor from the university of bradford who uh, supported me throughout this entire journey that's something important if this is a final thing uh, it's really important for us to understand that though these challenges that children have are, are complex abuse sexual abuse these are complex yeah. issues they're not hard to talk easy to talk about but it's it's so interesting that sometimes the solutions for, for some of the gravest challenges that we're facing are so simple um people every child needs at least one person to believe in them consistent who believes in them who encourages them and this was what made a difference in my life